the Niagara Music Community gather this week for the 12th annual NMAs. Musicians walk the red carpet at the gala event held at the Scotiabank Convention Center. Has this been a strong year for music here in Niagara? Yeah, I think it keeps getting stronger and stronger. I mean, Niagara is growing as a community, and uh, that, those people that are moving here to Niagara are demanding music and entertainment, and we have a macro vision of providing tourism through music and entertainment, and we have a lot of it, so we might as well bring it to the world. What's your reaction to the turnout tonight? Oh, I think it's great. We got a sold out event for the last uh, three or four years in a row. We keep growing, we keep adding more seats and people keep coming. Thank you very much everybody. Yeah, Niagara music and Niagara talent. 22 awards were handed out tonight in categories ranging from hip hop, jazz and country. When we uh, first set out to do our album, we had no idea the response was going to be so overwhelming. We're extremely excited to be here. And you're nominated in six categories tonight. Which one are you most excited about? Six categories. I think we're most excited about probably uh, uh, Best New Group because it's the first year that we've really um, considered ourselves an original group. We've been a cover band for years. We've been playing together for many, many years. But now is the time that we're really uh, spearheading ourselves as, uh, as an original band. What are you nominated for tonight? Hip Hop Artist of the Year. Are you familiar with the other nominees? I am. Actually, a lot of them are really close friends. We've all worked together throughout the years. This thing has been going on for 12 years. This animal, we're getting big. Canada, what's up? See us. What does being nominated mean to you? You know what it means? It means the reason to keep going. It means the reason why I need to show my daughter that working hard and perseverance is going to get you somewhere one day. Keeping things on track as hosts of this year's NMAs were TV personalities Patrick Gillardi and Jillian Mandich. So we got some rockers, we got some punkers, we got some jazzy people here. It's really cool demographic here. I love it. I really wanted to get into the mindset, so I've been listening to a lot of the music of all the nominees trying to get ready today, which is actually really cool now to see people in person walking the red carpet. And you know, I really have just been trying to get in a mindset of like celebration. The former CEO of the Academy of Country Music made a special trip from Nashville to help judge the country music category. I was very impressed. Um, you know, it's, uh, it, I, I certainly have seen many aspiring country music singers and songwriters over my 32-year career in the music business, whether I was at the Grand Ole Opry or working for Warner Brothers or running the Academy of Country Music. And it's a very impressive uh, crop. And, uh, you know, it's just great that uh, the Niagara region is lifting up its talent like this. You know, um, a lot of times we focus on business and we focus on tourism and certainly those things are the heartbeat of what makes cities run. But you know, arts and music and dance is really the soul of, of, of the community and uh, it's important to nurture that soul. And, uh, and that soul will give back in real economic terms over time. And, and I just think what, what the Niagara Music Awards folks are doing here tonight is wonderful and uh, it's definitely worth paying attention to. It's more than an award show. The NMAs represent the one night of the year that the industry is able to get together. What are your impressions of the nominees tonight? They're all really fantastic. I've been around for you know, my whole life in Niagara and I've been in the scene in various ways and stuff. So. It's great to see such a wonderful event that promotes Niagara musicians like this one. How would you describe the current music scene here in Niagara? Um, eclectic and fun. There's a lot of talent in this community. It's vibrant. It's thriving with talent. And uh, this is an, an amazing uh, opportunity for people to be recognized. It's all about the community. I mean, this doesn't, wouldn't exist without them, right? So it's a matter of everybody coming together and uh, showing that they love Niagara music and we have some great Niagara musicians that stay here and are professional musicians and also that have moved on beyond Niagara and we have some of them back with us tonight. Congratulations to all those involved and for a full list of tonight's winners visit niagaramusicawards.ca. Reporting for The Source in Niagara Falls, I'm Jordan James.